Kane will lead the three Lions as they look to make amends for their humiliating last 16 defeat to Iceland at Euro 2016. And despite England having only won the tournament once in 1966, the Tottenham striker is feeling bullish about their chances of going all the way this time around. It's impossible not to dream about lifting the World Cup, it's the biggest competition in the world, he told a news conference. For me, it's going to be a massive dream to play in it. It's impossible not to think about that. I believe we can win it. I think anyone can. I can't sit here and say we're not going to win it because we could do. It's just my mindset. I want to win at everything I do and I know a lot of players in the team want to win at everything they do. That's what we're going to try and do. It's going to be extremely hard, there's some really good teams in the World Cup, but it's worth fighting for. Those dreams of lifting it, I'm sure we've all had them. It's an opportunity for us and we're going to fight and give it everything we've got, Kane, it's a massive honor. You always dream of playing for England growing up, and to be the captain is that little bit more. To be leading the lads out is going to be special. Pick that twitter.com slash ERs date before huge England at England the 22nd of May 2018 Kane says England have been guilty of approaching major tournaments with a negative outlook in previous years and hopes to oversee a shift in mentality. Maybe we're a bit afraid to say we want to win stuff because we're afraid of the reaction of the media or the fans, he added, maybe that's made the players go into a bit of a shell. What I'm trying to say is we're not afraid to say we want to win it because every country wants to win it. We have to be brave, we have to take it on the chin. Whether we go out in the group stage or the semi-finals, it's the same, you don't win the World Cup. That's what we've got to discuss as players is to have no fear, and the 24-year-old, who has been one of a number of captains on rotation since Gareth Southgate took charge, is confident the extra responsibility will not affect his form in front of goal. Since I've had the armband for England I've scored a few goals. I'm hoping that continues, he explained. For me it's a massive thing and I'm extremely proud to wear the armband but I still have to go out there and do my job, work hard for the team first and foremost and then try and score. So far it's worked well, England begin their campaign against Tunisia on June 18th, before taking on Panama and Belgium in Group G.